All right, guys, here we are. It feels so good to have the sled back out on the ice. Uh, let's set the hut up here quick. This is actually a new hut and uh, get to fishing. <laughs> Smart guys. I'm gonna have my big camera out. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, my rod's bent right over. <sighs> oh, he ate that good. I got a single hole here. <laughs> wow. I want to call my buddy, see if he's here. He can help me land it. Because that would be great. Holy crap, this feels so good. <laughs> He's gonna get stuck in my tube. I get stuck in my tube. Yeah. Damn it. Hi there, you reached. No, he's not here. Sorry guys, this is a little bit of a mess right now. I only have one camera set up. I'm barely set up. This lake trout's stuck in my tube now. <sighs> Let's see if I can get him up here. <sighs> Come here. <sighs> All right. Oh, I see him. Oh, I see him in the other, in the other hole. Yeah, I got my other line. What a mess. What a mess. What a mess. He hanged his head. There you go. Oh god. I hacked myself. I lived this Lake trail, guys. What a mess. I don't know what to do here, guys. I literally have myself hooked. I literally hooked myself with my, uh, with my vibrato. Okay. 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 Just chill. <sighs> All right. All right, yeah, guys. Yeah. Look at that. First smirk of the day. First lake trout of the day. Saw a 10 pounder probably. Ugh. We're gonna release him right here. All right, bud. Thank you for the good fight. Oh yeah, right away. Right away. <laughs> Guys, what a shit show. What a shit show. First mark of the day. You guys are little here. I thought it was a whitefish at first because I was jigging up high and he was cutting up slowly. But then I was like, you know what? Like, it could be a laker. <laughs> so I started reeling, kept reeling and reeling. He sped up, sped up, sped up, sped up, sped up, sped up. And I didn't even see him bite on my uh, graph. My rod just bent woo, right over. <laughs> and, uh,. My second lake trout of Lake Simcoe of the year. 
Um, but that's my biggest one so far, probably around 10 pounds or so. Beautiful, beautiful fish. Um, I was bleeding a little bit. He started bleeding a little bit, so I released him as soon as I could there. Sorry if I'm like talking and not saying anything, just rambling on. I'm like a little shocked, honestly. Like I knew when I came out here today, I was like, I want a lake trout. <laughs> like that's what I came here for. But I did not think that my first mark uh, was gonna bite and it was gonna be a lake trout. So I'm a little bit like loopy, a little bit. <laughs> cool. A little, uh, like I'm shaking. <laughs> like, <laughs> hopefully you guys saw that lake trout. Okay, it's uh, I got a quick pick outside. I'll show you guys. Like really, really quick though, uh, cause it's cold. So I I wanted to get that fish back as soon as I could. Um, but hopefully you guys got a good look. And it was beautiful, beautiful fish. But uh. <sighs> I'm trying to get this is what I caught it on by the way uh, 10 gram I think yeah 10 gram vibrato so I'm going to um, get this back on my other rod and deal with these two rods that are an absolute mess right now another one another one I don't see him where'd he go he's following me oh he's gonna eat it He's on it so hard. He's on it so hard. Eat it. Eat it. Oh, come on. Eat it. He ate it. No, he didn't. I thought he ate it. I thought he ate it. Well, you guys can see that, okay, there? <laughs> Chase me all the way to the ice, guys. All the way to the ice. He's on it on the way down. I'm dropping it right now. Let's see. Come on. Yeah, he's on it. He's on it. I kind of lost interest a little bit. He's following me all the way to the bottom. I'm gonna try to get him off bottom. And if I can't, I'm gonna try uh, reeling up again. He kind of went away. Oh, he's still there. Barely. Wow, it's been uh, a rough couple of days out here on the water. Um, last two times i've been out i've hit the good old skunk <laughs> um and honestly like marking a lot of fish to all the places i go it's just getting them to bite has been my issue it seems to be a pretty common consensus right now um i've been paying attention to like the lake simcoe forums and stuff like that uh seems to be pretty uh pretty difficult <laughs> right now to catch fish. I'm happy that I did today because uh, that lake trout was sweet. There you go. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> he had it in his mouth for a while before I noticed. I'll oh, stay off that ice. Well, and there he goes. <laughs> I tried pulling up on the bait and pulled it right out, but first white fish of the day right there. I wish I landed him, but I'm happy I uh, hooked one and got that sweet fight out of it. <laughs> Eat it. Eat it. Oh, come on. 
Wow. Just one of those. He was on it pretty good. <laughs> Just never ate it. All right, guys. Uh, that is a wrap for me today. I'm going to fish it out here. Probably five more minutes. I'm going to pack up and head home. Um, overall, pretty happy with the day, to be honest with you guys. Um, comparing it to the last couple of days I've had out on the water, um, definitely a lot better. I uh, managed that lake trout um, in the morning. Had a couple more chasers that, that wouldn't commit. And uh, missed one whitefish that bit and uh, lost that one whitefish at the hole that <laughs> I screwed up. It was totally my fault. Uh, hopefully the fishing just gets better and better and better uh, <laughs> from here on out because I've been in a little bit of a skunk lately. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to leave links to uh, the rod wheel and line I used down below in the description. And um, yeah, feels good to get my like first decent sized Lake Simcoe Lake Trout of the year and uh, hopefully uh, many more to come. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one.